Okay, some sentence transformations. Carla thinks it would be better if Tom discovered the answer for himself. Found. So, Carla would prefer that Tom found, found out the answer for himself. So, Carla would prefer Tom found the answer for himself. Yeah, himself, not herself. Um, yeah, that's fine. You could add out, but it's not necessary. He found the answer. He found out the answer for himself. I think both would work. <clears throat> he left the house early, but he arrived after he expected. Off. Despite. Okay. Despite getting off the house early, he arrived late. So this he arrived late is fine. So, despite getting off the house, this doesn't work. Um, let's see, if we had didn't have the house, despite getting off, er, off early, he arrived late. That would work. To get off, you can use intransitively. However, getting off the house, this implies he was on the house. So, Despite getting off from the house, yeah, getting off from the house, and I think it would be better than getting, setting off from the house early. Okay, despite setting off from the house early, he arrived late. Despite setting off, getting off early, he arrived late. So, despite getting setting off early he arrived late so notice you need this from yeah setting off intransitive setting off from plus indirect object unless this weather really changes overnight We'll leave at 6 a.m. No. Providing. Okay. Providing that there is no change in the weather overnight, we'll leave at 6 a.m. Perfect. Well done. The desert was completely devoid of trees. Ha. Ah. Okay. There. There were no trees whatsoever in the desert. Good. You could also say there were no trees in the desert whatsoever, but this has got to be the right spot for them for that. Patrick wanted to guarantee that everything was as it should be on his wedding day. Leave. Patrick didn't. Okay, so let's see what you've put. Patrick didn't leave nothing to chance on his wedding day. So here you've got a, ne a double negative. So a double negative in, in English, this means that Patrick did leave something to chance. He didn't leave nothing, he did leave some things. So instead of nothing, this has got to be anything didn't leave anything to chance on his wedding day. Susan didn't tell Dan about the bill until he'd finished dinner. Four. Okay, so Susan waited for Dan to finish his dinner before telling him about the bill. Perfect, well done. Don't let his relaxed manner fool you. He's an extremely clever businessman. Taken. So the phrasal verb they're looking for is to take in. S what man? So, don't, don't be taken for a fool 
by his relaxed manner. He's an extremely clever businessman. So I guess this don't be taken for a fool. But if somebody takes you for a fool, they consider that you're an idiot. Yeah, so yes, I guess I guess this works. I think the answer that that they're looking for though is don't be taken in by whoops taken in by his ex his relaxed manner he's an extremely clever businessman it's none of your business who i go out with betsy informed her mother concern okay so Betsy informed his mother that who his friends were, no concern of hers. Okay, yeah, it, uh, okay, so notice the first thing, there's a mistake here. It should say her and her yeah but that's my bad because betsy betsy normally short betty elizabeth okay so betsy informed his mother that who his friends were was no concern of hers so if you look at this this whole phrase Betsy informed his mother that who his friends were, or who his friends were, all of that is the subject, was no concern of hers. So Betsy informed his mother that it was no concern of hers. So you need this extra was, yeah? Okay, and that, that's how it works. So, informed her mother that's from the question who her friends were was no concern of hers this were was looks a bit weird she'd prefer it if you kept it to yourself she'd so she'd rather you did not talk about it to anyone yeah that works very nicely good here you she'd rather you did not talk about it to anyone not talk anyone when he had another look at the manuscript i was when when he and i so i think yeah he <laughs> when he had another look at the manuscript he was really impressed by its quality on on having gone through the manuscript again he was really impressed by it that works very nicely on having gone through yeah i i think that works it wasn't what i was i, I was thinking of but i think that works right let me try what I would say is on a second look through he was really impressed by on the second uh, look through the manuscript on a second look through the manuscript he was really impressed by its quality. Or even on look at yeah, on looking through on looking through the manuscript again, he was really impressed. On looking through the manuscript again, on having gone through I guess it works. It's a little bit top heavy though. But on having gone through, on going through the manuscript again, he was really impressed by its quality. 
I think probably better on going. So, thank you very much. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you soon. Bye for now.